Uh, hi, my name is Sana Shams. I work at Center for Language Engineering at the University of Engineering and Technology, Lahore, in Pakistan. Uh, I work as a manager research over there. Uh, so the project had three objectives. The first one was we wanted to investigate the extent of use of OER by students and teachers at both secondary as well as tertiary levels. Secondly, we wanted to find out uh, perceived barriers, enablers, inhibiting factors reported by both students and teachers at both the secondary and tertiary levels of education and then the impact of the OER in education. Um, we did a, a questionnaire survey and followed by specific interviews of students and teachers. Um, for the school, um, uh, while exploring uh, OER use at school level, we first conducted an administrator survey, then the students and teachers survey. Roughly uh, uh, more than 3,000 students of schools as well as university were uh, interviewed and um, about uh, more than 200 school teachers and about 150 uh, university teachers were interviewed. Um, the, very, um, the primary finding of our research was that most of the time students as well as teachers, they were not aware of what OER was and how it is contextualized, reused, remixed, most of the people who even were using OER didn't know it was OER and they didn't know that they were producing OERs, which was actually being done. Uh, 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 there were only few cases in which that was being done. So most of the people were not aware uh, of, the, uh, of the OERs at all. And then uh, the teachers, students, they um, said that uh, the major barriers they faced in the use of OER was uh, that it is very time consuming and uh, they need technological infrastructure and then uh, they need more training to develop OERs. The key finding of the research was that uh, you need to have an institutional infrastructure in place, some policy that will guide the implementation and development of OER at any institution, be it the secondary level or the tertiary level. That's, that's of primary importance because we saw use wherever there was an institution or policy behind it. Uh, voluntary use and reuse was very limited. Uh, in all the case study, uh, in all the uh, projects that we saw.